Astros and the Tigers. Astros are ready to hit. So is Jordan Alvarez. Actually, good to have his back for him. He just in he just needs some good innings, turned into good starts, and he'll be back to the fromber that leads this rotation. The corner, and it's always nice when you go. Wow. The shape a little bit different on that cutter. Elevating that pitch flattens out, it gets hit. Matches from super. He gets 0-2 on Riley Green. Green, the right fielder tonight. Instead, he gets a fastball here at 0-2 that backs him off the plate. It's 1-2. Just missed the outside edge. There's that zone. Try to hold up, and he just gets a piece. Stays 2-2. Two and two. There goes the runner on a 2-2 pitch. It's in and not handled cleanly by Maldonado's. And a little tapper right side that's going to go foul. That pitch stays inside, and that'll be a walk. So Fromber, after Miguel starts the night, as you can see, with 509 career home runs and three head. Fromber doesn't get that call at the top of the zone, and it's 2-0. Oh. That looks like 2-0 oh pitch is fouled away. There is a strike two and two. Change ups. Now a pretty important pitch coming. Into right field, sending Tucker back near the wall. Tucker yesterday. So now a pitch into Zach Short. Here's into the third baseman, Zach Short. Short face Fromber. Green a little more of a threat to run than Rod. That one wide, two and one. Ground ball towards third. Bregman's going to come home with it. The catcher, Rogers, is going to. Definitely an awkward play for the runner. Still awkward for the catcher as well. For 10 against him. Fromber missing down, two and oh. Yeah, being that it is. 19. Not going to hit the runner as he was coming down the line. Now Fromber misses on the first three to hop. There's a strike. That's impressive. There you go on a 3-1 pitch. Didn't draw the walk. Instead, it's... And a ground ball towards Paney on two big hops. And Baez is retired. Uniform colors as well. This guy at the plate, Jose Abreu, really... Gets a strike there, dropped in by Matt Manning. And he grounds this one towards third. Nice short hop play by Zach Short. Yeah. Pena. Pena takes one that could have been below the knees, but called a strike 0 1. Now JP down on the count 0 2. Pena stays alive, grounding one foul. It's one of Pena tried to check his swing, and it's going to say it hit his bat last. Get right here with that fastball up on our match from Supermoni gets the glove. That should be Nielsen moving in from the corners, and this spot hit Maldonado. I have no idea how he butted that field in for Altuve, and that one almost gets away. Abreu thought about it, but stays at third. That one's a called strike, one and one. And Altuve taking a couple of strikes. It's one and two. And he taps one towards third. Here comes Abreu. And not handled by the third. For activities. Nice. And Taylor Rhodes is got you covered. No, Parker Meadows facing Fromber Valdez. Counts two. And that one's in. And Fromber has started out against the nine hitter this inning with it so far in his career. And he draws a four-pitch walk for Fromber to start the inning. Gather himself, regroup when things weren't going well. Beerling's going to get tagged out by Abreu. They've got to really have their outings and their innings dictated by that clock. This one grounded towards the middle where Jose Altuve is. Use that old technique of regrouping, regathering, and refocusing. And ERA in his last seven games. This one grounded foul. And Fromberg can see his way out of this inning if he can get Torkel's time up. Stays alive by fouling one back. 0-2 pitch. Woo. Yeah, you'd like to have that one. 
No foul. Stays one and two. Swing and a miss. That'll do it for the Tigers in the third inning as Torkelson. Ends, but find your way into win streaks and a good time for his team to play well. Only dwindling on the season as Kyle Tucker flied out to left on the first pitch he saw. One month and one week left in the season. And 33 games were made. Now have a chance to control their own destiny by playing good. Deep to center field, all the way back to the wall, leaping. Things about Meadows in center field. We got a little taste of it right there. 26 in game is Yiner Diaz bats. Jordan sending that one 417 feet from home. The baseball like we just saw. Well, Yiner hits one to left. That's going to be three fly out. Chopper towards third. Alex Bregman with the catcher running. Takes 1668 tied with Melot. This one slowly hit towards Altuve. Jose will take his time. And that one's down. That'll be another walk issue by Frommer. That's three. Altuve. This one grounded towards third. Altuve is not going to get this ball. Instead, it's going to go to first. One and two, the count to Chaz McCormick. And Chaz goes down on strikes. Matt Manning picks up his first strike. Altuve was going to get an RBI either way as Riley Green comes on and makes this play on day. So it's the first combined no-hitter in franchise history as Manning still hasn't allowed much, although that's a... And Maldi goes down on strikes. Manning starts and ends the inning with a strikeout. So Matt... On the ground, one big hop for Alex Bregman. Another ground ball out. That'll be in. He'll walk the nine-hitter for a second time tonight. There goes the runner on a 2-2 pitch, grounded right to Abreu. So the Tigers moving, Meadows pays off. His head. And he gets him, another changeup. Every pitch in that at bat was up. And he drove in a run, would have had a run our way on a fielder's choice, but he was giving credit for a hit. This was, how about that? None of them resulting in. Ground ball to short, makes this be able to go out there and try and smash for extra base hits. Matt Manning pitching very well has a line up for the third time tonight and Torkelson pops for it. First base side, Jose Abreu. And he picks up strikeout number three, getting his former minor league battery mate Jake Rogers. And Fromber looks like he might have his first clean inning since the first, and he does. Manning or Fromber Valdez tonight. Jordan made a bid last time, hitting one 417 feet. He'll get credit one two count he inherited. White for two outs and two strikes. He walked off the mound after that last flyout. Now he can walk off the mound. He got him. Cabrera waves and misses. Looks out. That one's down. That'll by matching his season high and one off his career. Call third strike. He dotted him up on the inside corner and Javi. Swing and a miss. It cannot run. And that's going to help Maldonado make the three well. Abreu oh, goes down on three pitches. White has been as efficient as... Well, I think Meadows finally got to the point where he said, I'm going to swing because I haven't gotten a pitch to hit yet. Well, there goes Pena. One-two pitch. Swing and a miss. The throw by Rogers. Head first slide. Out at second base. For two on the in this ball game, so they have not had many opportunities. Only bunted both runners along. That one up and in on out two base. Pena having a battle here. That's well wide. It's one and two. After it, he knows what happens. That's, an, that's another great point. You can tell by the reaction of the, the player. First pitch swinging. Matt Beerling pops one up on the infield. Jose Abreu will tell Brian. Catcher's gear. On the ground, base hit. That will be the first hit of the night for the Tigers. Both teams now. Ground ball towards the middle. On two base there. Steps on the bag. Throws to first. Yeah. Bregman pops one. Green and Meadows converge. It is going to be right about that. That one is going to that hit the glove of catcher's interference. That is going to be the fourth air. There goes Tucker. The pitch is wide. No to have his 25th stolen base to go along with short from third to second. And that's ball four. So you're not to see the alignment. Ground ball slowly hit towards. Shiner's going to have to hustle to beat this throw, and he is safe. On you know, Yiner got down the line in 28.8. How about that? 28.8. McCormick slowly hit towards third. Gobbled up there by Beerling, his first.